thousand years and more, it's been a cradle of Western civilization. From the birth of the Roman Empire, through the glories of the Middle Ages to the flowering of the Renaissance, its achievements are just breathtaking. But so much of that invention and creativity still remains invisible. I'm exploring three Italian cities to understand how their hidden treasures played a crucial part in the making of Italy and of our world. I'll be working with a team of experts who'll use the latest 3D technology to reveal this secret underworld like never before. In this program, we're exploring the hidden secrets of one of the most remarkable cities on Earth, built out of the waters of a lagoon, Venice. I'll discover how Venice's beauty once masked a ruthless secret state and a world of excess and vice. Gambling and sex. Gambling and sex. Yeah. We'll see how the Venetians built their city around money-making. Venice was a very important commercial city, maybe the most important in the world. And created one of Europe's mightiest empires. The smell of power is reeking in the air. For the first time, we'll use virtual reality. I'm taller than the tower. And find out how the Venetians turned a muddy swamp into this watery wonderland. The second leg of my mission to reveal Invisible Italy begins at the airport taxi rank. I've been coming here for years, not just to admire the wonderful art and architecture, but also because I have family here. But this time, I'm here to explore an invisible Venice. Our story has to begin with the lagoon all around me. Just how do people not only survive, but thrive in a place like this? Venice is built in over 500 square kilometers of shallow lagoon on 118 islands. Most of them are just inches above sea level. The first Venetians were Romans who started building here in the fifth century AD when the empire was in a state of collapse. Well, I've come to a rather unprepossessing part of the Venetian lagoon to get my feet quite literally into what is real Venice, the mud.